guys get rid of me. I'm checking the back of my hair to see if the thingy looks good because I don't know how to do a clock lip. The ends of my hair are like so raggedy. I'm getting a trim though on Sunday, but it's not just that. It's just like non-brushed, but I'm getting a trim on Sunday. And I don't know if I should just like get a trim, like just cut off an inch or if I should like go bob. Like guys, what if I came back and I had like a buzz cut? What would we think of that? And also, I was going to get highlights, like, me and my, well, I wasn't going to, but my mom was like, do you want to get highlights? Because I was talking about how I want to get highlights. But at the same time, I like my hair dark, and that will make my hair look lighter. So I was like, um, no, maybe next time. But then I asked my friends, and a lot of them were like, no, just keep your natural hair. Just cut off the excess blonde from my freaking under dye. So that's what I'm doing on me on sunday well maybe because there still might be a little bit of blonde left because i think i'm only going to cut off like an inch and yeah so i think i'm going to keep some of the blonde left but most of it will be gone which is okay and i'm being a little less by me today one because i'm color coordinating blue clocklet blue hoodie which i stole from grayson like six months ago she hasn't asked for back sorry grayson i love you Okay, but, and I'm also wearing leggings instead of sweatpants, which I don't know why I'm doing that, but I am, so yeah. I'll show you the fit at the end of the video. Guys, I really want to start using my pawns again, but I'm pretty sure that's why I was breaking out. My skin's, like, clear now, and when I was using it, you know go, you know go? You guys know how, like, my skin, like, what? Okay, anyway. I got something in my eyeball. Guys, I feel like the reason, like, my get ready for me is get no likes in the morning. Because I have nothing going on in my brain. Like, I'll start just, like, talking about nonsense. I'm like... But I woke up, like, a little bit earlier today. So, I feel like I have a little bit more energy. Also, I might go to a volleyball open gym today. Because we don't have a tournament this weekend. This is, like, one of our only weekends we don't. So, like, I can go to open gym. Because my dad doesn't let me go to open gym when we have a tournament. Because he's scared I'm going to, like, hurt myself. And also, like, he wants me to go to bed at, like, freaking 9. Because most of the time our tournaments, I have to wake up at, like, 4. So, I kind of get it. Because, like... He's saving me. But, anyways. But the thing was, Jayla was going to take me with her to open gym because her parents are working it today. But she said she can't. So, I mean, my dad can take me. But, like, guys, I don't even know if I want to go like that. Also, you know what's so embarrassing is when, like, a guy finds your get ready with me. Or just, like, brings it up. Like, I have, like, all my guy friends, like, know that I have a get ready with me. But as soon as they start talking about it, I'm like, bro, such a trapper. I mean, yapper. Like, <laughs> Um, as soon as they start yapping about it, I'm like, stop. And especially to my freaking, like, when I have a man. And they're like, did you know she has a... And I'm just like, stop. Like, you're not a sweet, kind, caring person. You know what you're doing. You know what you're doing. Because who, like, imagine, like, you're talking to a guy and he has to get ready with me. Like, okay, maybe it's not that bad, but, like, I was like, hey, guys. Get ready with me. Which is what I do, and that's embarrassing. So, like, yeah. And also, guys, my freaking naked braces. Like, what is that? I need color, like, right now. Like, this isn't okay. Okay, that was actually a pretty good curl, so let's hope my lashes turn out good. Also, guys, I'm trying to cherish my last moments, with, like, last couple months with you guys if TikTok gets banned. If TikTok gets banned, people are like, what are you going to do, Alyssa? Like, guys, I don't really want to post on Instagram reels. Like, I hate to break it to you guys. Maybe, and I will just do nothing. Sorry. No, but, like, I just hope it doesn't get banned. Because, like, TikTok's so easy to make videos and post on Instagram. You can't, like, record just there. Like, I don't know how to even work Instagram, guys. I'm kind of a bot. I forgot to do my eyebrows earlier, so we're just going to do them really quick. My lashes are, like, not really lashing. They are, but they aren't. Because they don't, like, look amazing, but they don't look terrible. That was, like, really hard. F what? That was, like, really hard for me to say. I'm not really sure why. But, anyways. Also, why are people wearing shorts right now? Like, it's, like, 60 degrees out. And the other day, it was 70, and people were walking around in Nike Pro. And I'm sorry, but I think that's a little odd. Um, to wear Nike Heroes out. Maybe? Okay, that's just a personal opinion. 
It's like I use that for my sport. Other people use that for my for their sport. And I think that there's so many other types of shorts you can wear. Like, if you want to wear tight black shorts, get tight black shorts. But just don't get Nike Pros because those are athletic shorts. And like, guys, they never have my size anymore. And then I look around in school and there's 20 girls wearing that. <sighs> okay. Anyways, I'm done getting ready. But yeah, should I pull out pieces? I'm not sure. It really did nothing. Okay. Peace. My makeup with me, except I have to blend everything in with the packaging. My skin is gonna break out so bad. So the first thing I'm gonna start off with is primer, but as always, please comment if I get one of your free I noticed a lot of you guys have been commenting it. Let's keep that up. So yeah, put a comment, put comment FYP if I get on your free you <sighs> I was just gonna blend it in with my hand, but I realized I can only use the packaging. The things I'm risking for my skin. Now I'm gonna do concealer, and honestly, I genuinely don't know how this is gonna work out because. How am I going to blend this in? I guess like this. I think, yeah. That's low-key working out. Okay. But today, I'm just going for like, kind of like a soft girl makeup. So we're going to do some blush. This is easy. All I have to do is this to kind of blend it in. But also make sure to leave your comments, not comments, challenges down below if you want to be included in a video. Look at how like bright pink that is. That looks so cute. So now we're just going to do some contour. This contour is on this last life. And then I'm going to do this one too. Just because, like, the last one didn't really show too well. And I'm just going to kind of go like that. Let's just hope I don't break out. And I'm just going to set my face really quick. Now I'm going to use this setting powder. And this is the packaging. So, like, you know, I get a free pass. The powder always does me pretty well. So, yeah. So we're going to take this. Go here. Up here. And get my corners kind of like that oh that's not blended in all the way hold on this is why I like i'm also gonna do some more blush because yeah y'all see that i'm literally like scratching the product that's like so crazy to me and i'm gonna use some more blush but i don't think i'm gonna be able to um get my inner corners this makeup looks coming out different from like the ones that i would do look at how cute that looks for some reason i cannot find my lip liner so we're gonna use this elf lip oil and i'll just blend it in with the packaging which is this. I think we're done. I'm just going to use some more setting spray. But if you stayed all the way, make sure to comment down below a black heart. Or just like a black emoji. Bye guys. And remember that God loves you. I mean to go to my boyfriend's. So he's kind of sick right now. But I really love him. Um, so I'm willing to risk getting sick with him. But I want to go hang out with him. So this is the outfit, I think. Because I just I want to be cozy for when I go. And I also just got this bag from TikTok shop. It's like the dupe of free people. There's nothing in it, so that's why it looks like that. But Also, guys, I'm kind of like already ready, but we're just going to touch it up a little bit because I've been laying around. also ordered DoorDash to my house, and then it was so good. I had like um, street tacos, and then I had like pepperoncinis with it. And I don't know if it's just me, you guys, but I just like take pepperoncinis out of like the thing and just eat them like pickles. They're so freaking good. I feel like you can kind of see it. Oh, what the heck? There's something there's something in my teeth. I'm just gonna take oh, wait, did I get it? Yeah. I was about to like rip my hair out, like just a tad like strand and then like floss my teeth. <laughs> Is that weird? Does anyone else do that? Like, oh my gosh, when I don't wanna get floss or if I don't have floss, I'll just use my hair. <laughs> um, I'm kinda bummed that my boyfriend's sick because I didn't know he was sick until he doesn't ever the thing about my boyfriend you guys is he never like says anything that's wrong with him like he doesn't tell me when he has problems with anything in his life <laughs> he can talk to me but the thing is like he doesn't complain like he doesn't sit there and be like I don't feel good or you know what I mean like he's just not like that and then me on the other hand like I'll be like honey I don't feel good like right when I have a headache or right when I don't feel good I'll tell him I don't feel good but with him he doesn't let me know so I didn't even know he was sick for like two days and I guess he'd been sick for two days. And I called him on the phone and he sounded all congested and I was like, oh my gosh, are you sick? And like the thing about him is like, he won't even say that he's sick. Like he was like, no, I'm not sick. And I'm like, you sound so sick. You're, you're sick. And he just like won't say that he is. So guys, my eyes are strained. I am so blurry right now. It's because I've been on my phone for so long. Like I should have worn my blue light glasses, but I didn't because I don't know. I just kind of...
forgot. Now I'm just like blind. Like I went to like get up and like I was like literally like this, just like looking at everything. I kind of want to curl my hair. Should I curl my hair? No, I'm trying to get it the healthiest it could be, so I'm not gonna put heat on it. Here's the makeup look. I look the same as I did when I started the video, but it's okay. Bye guys. Good morning. It's currently 9:40, and it's tournament day. So let's go. To pop those retainers out. I was brushing my tongue and I gagged so hard I was threw up. So we are wearing black jerseys and blue shorts today, which I'm very excited about because we always wear blue jerseys. I think we have to leave here by 12.45 to get there at 2. And then we play at 3. Our coach just wants us there an hour early to warm up. I think we play three games today, and then I don't know how many we ref and sits. I'm so glad that our tournaments aren't like super early in the morning because last season our tournaments were so early but now they're like midday so it's like kind of nice i don't know what the tournament name is called so if you see me you see me if you don't you don't but last time so many of you guys saw me it was so funny i need to get my eyebrows done so bad they're so bad but i think i'm just gonna wait till snow coming to get them done so they're like fresh okay i'm gonna do my eyelashes and then i'll be back okay lashes <clears throat> are done now i'm gonna do my hair okay so i just did like ponytail into a braid because my hair is greasy and i didn't want to do anything else with it but yeah that's it bye guys throughout my life i've wanted so many different jobs and careers so i'm gonna share them all with you starting off with what i've wanted to do since as long as i can remember which is marine biology, but one day my mom told me, she was like, Mia, you're not going to make enough money in that job, and I don't want to see you struggle, so pick something else. I 100% understand where my mom is coming from, and I'm honestly glad that she told me that, but a piece of me died that day, and I still think about marine biology all the time, like literally every single day, and I already regret not being able to do that as a job. The next job I've always wanted is to be an actor. I don't know, I've just always been so fascinated with movies and TV shows and acting. And if I could pick my absolute dream job, it would be actor slash marine biologist slash like A-list celebrity influencer. Super realistic, not delusional at all. I love pushing the boundaries of society. So the next job I would like is to be the first female to pull out fill the groundhog out of his little stump and like announce groundhog day if you haven't noticed phil the groundhog is always taken out of his little stump by a man and it's like on the little podium thing it's all men so i want to be the first female to do it another career that i had a really hard time letting go of was being a doctor a surgeon or a physical therapist I just got to the point where I realized that I was just not smart enough for medical school or like the classes, so I had to give that one up. When YouTube was at its prime, I wanted to be a YouTuber, and me and my friends would make fake YouTube videos on our iPads. There was also a time I really wanted to be a veterinarian, but I didn't realize that you have to go to major school for that also, and I just, I don't have the brain for that. I never really wanted to be a princess, but I did go through a phase where I wanted to be a queen. For some reason, I don't even know how that came about. This one's actually pretty recent, which is kind of embarrassing, but I wanted to work at like an acai bowl cafe, specifically in Hawaii, or own an acai bowl place in Hawaii, like right by the beach. When I was really young, I did go through a phase where I wanted to be an astronaut. I mentioned this a little bit earlier, but A-list celebrity, that's not really a job, but I still think that is really, really cool, and if that happened to me, I'd be cool with it. I'm currently in college, and I'm majoring in strategic communication and minoring in business. After I graduate, I either want to do public relations for a beauty or fashion brand or medical sales. I'm enjoying what I'm learning right now, but if someone had a magic wand and I could become a marine biologist slash actor slash a list celebrity influencer i'd be on the first plane out 